Good morning. Just heading out to load the wood boiler. Why don't you guys come along, see how it's done. First, I like to check the temperature to see what it's at first thing in the morning. Let's see what we got here. About 172 degrees. And right now I got it set to kick on at 170. So really the best time to load this is when the fan's already on so you're not kicking it on in between cycles, but that's all right. So first, we're gonna get ourselves some wood. Looks like we had a little rain and snow over the night. <sighs> not always a glamorous job, but it's gotta be done. Sometimes I'll use a wheelbarrow. The trick is finding that sweet spot. You really want just enough wood in here to last about 12 hours. So that way when you check it, it's not full of wood and you don't just keep on putting the wood to her. You want it to burn down a little bit and then, you know, rake the coals around, fill it up again. Come on a little closer, see how this is done. All right, before I open the door, always push the button if the fan's not on already. That way you don't get a burst of flames coming out at you when the air hits. So wait about 20 seconds or so. So it looks like I overfilled a little bit last night. That's okay. Sometimes I'll stick the back end of this thing in here. Not too deep. You don't want to hit that nozzle down at the bottom, but kind of lift up on this wood, get the stuff all raked around here. I always like to check these mating surfaces here to make sure there's nothing, nothing there that's gonna make it not seal. We'll just put the wood in. It's gonna be kind of a rainy, snowy, dreary day today. So it is gonna be a little warmer though. It's, we won't fill it super full, but I don't think there's gonna be much sunshine to help us. Today. I think that's I think that's full enough. I'll be home today, so I can check on it later. The last thing, every time. Shake that back and forth a few times. If you've seen my cleaning videos, you know that, that operates some turbulator tubes that goes up and down and cleans the back out. So that way those stay free of ash and things like that, so. But, that's low in the boiler in the morning, you know? It's, uh, it's not raining and snowing like crazy or anything out here, but some days it is, but. It's all gotta be done, no matter the weather, you gotta keep your house warm, so. So just a quick little video on how I load the wood boiler in the morning, and uh, I'll come back out here, you know, in 12, 13 hours tonight, and check it and fill it up again. But uh, if you like these videos, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you want more content like this, uh, and other things that we do around the house. We'll see you on the next one.